As we gear up for this new school year, there's a couple of things that we want you to be praying for, for our preschool kids and our elementary kids. A couple of those things for our kids is that they would be a light to others in their school. We teach them how to pray, how to read their Bible, how to listen to God and how to love Him. And now we get to share that with other people. And our prayer is that our kids would go and they would share that with their friends, with their community, and so that we can reach more people and make more disciples for Jesus. So pray that in this dark world that they would be a light to their friends. Another thing that we're praying for for our kids is that they would find their identity in Christ. So many people right now are finding their identity in anything and everything. And we want our kids to know who God is and who He created them to be. So be in prayer for our kids as they find their identity in who God is. Hi, church family. I'm Amber Johansson, president of First Priority of Tampa Bay. Our mission at First Priority is to connect students with Christ and a supportive Christian community which is accomplished through our student-led Christian clubs on middle and high school campuses here in the Tampa Bay area. The First Party Clubs meet every week so our Christian student leaders can share the hope of Jesus with students who may not know Him. Last school year, we had over 11,400 students attend one of our 100 campus clubs and 458 students made a decision to follow Jesus. This school year, we are praying for 150 campus clubs and 15,000 students to attend. Will you please join me in this prayer? Please also pray for more Christian students to join our mission, for more teachers to host the weekly meetings, and for more churches to partner with us in this effort. Lastly, please pray for students who hear the gospel message that they will turn their hearts and minds to Jesus. This school year, we are trusting God's word to accomplish more than we can imagine or hope. Thank you, SDF for your generous support and prayers. We are so very grateful for you. Hi, my name is Melissa Carlovato and I get to serve as the area director for Young Life in South Tampa. We are so excited to be going into a new school year. Our leaders can't wait to get back into the swing of going to Friday night football games, meeting before school at coffee shops for Bible studies and just showing up where kids are. Young Life's mission is to do just that, to step into the world of kids, meet them right where they are, be consistent, and earn the right to tell them about a God who's crazy about them. We believe that every kid, every gender, age, race, and ability deserves a chance to hear about the God of the universe. We would love for STF to be praying for our many volunteer leaders across our high school, middle school, and special needs focused ministries as they gear up to run hard after kids this year. That God would give them energy, excitement, and patience that only He could give. Would you also join us in praying for teenagers all across South Tampa? Now more than ever, kids are faced with endless distractions, temptations, and hardships. We are so honored and humbled that we get to step into those spaces and offer hope and life through Jesus. Thank you for praying with us and for us. Hey church, we also wanna pray for our middle school and our high school students that are now going back to school. Being a middle school, a high school student now, it's really difficult. And there's a lot of temptations um, that many of us didn't feel even when we were that age. And so just a couple of things to pray for, for them. Number one, I wanna pray for integrity. We want our kids who are believers to walk into school, walking with Jesus every day with their faith at the forefront of their minds. The second thing we want to pray for is just boldness. We want our students who know Jesus to be people who bring their friends who are far from God, bring them close to God. We want to pray for boldness for our students so they live with a mission mindset as they're going into their school. And finally, we want to pray for unity, specifically for the students that consider STF and STF youth their home. We want to pray that they would be unified going into their schools this year, that we would have a group of missionaries at Plant High School and Robinson and Coleman and Wilson and Tinker and, and Bayshore and all the other schools in our area. We wanna pray that students would be unified. And finally, you can pray for me as I lead the personal growth program with the Plant football team, leading them through scripture, helping the kids out through life, and just pray that that would be another fruitful 
season of ministry for them because like I said, we wanna see people who are far from God be close to God this school year. Thanks for praying.